Hey guys, what's going on and welcome or welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be doing a lip swatch and a review of the newly launched Inside Cosmetics Matte Lip Ink. Now they have come out with 24 shades and I have picked out 10 of them. So as always, check the description box below to see the shade names. And for foundation shade reference, I'm NC40 in MAC and in Maybelline, I'm 310 Sun Beige. Now, before we can get into the description, the lip swatches, the pros and the cons, do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it whenever I upload and now let's jump right into the video. Okay, so let's go over with the features of these liquid lipsticks. Now it says that it is packed with pigment and nearly weightless formula, giving you bright, bold and beautiful lips that lasts all day long. It is quick drying and delivers an intense shot of matte pigment in one easy swipe. It imparts a shock of comfortable color that won't bleed or transfer. This highly pigmented liquid lip ink comes with a unique arrow applicator for precise application and intense color distribution. It also is waterproof and non-transfer long-lasting formula. So I picked these up off of Amazon and these are priced at 110 rupees a 4 ml of product. And like I mentioned before, they offer a total of 24 shades. So this is how the packaging looks like which comes in this transparent tube with a white cap and white writing and at the top you have is the shade name and number. This is how the applicator looks like. And now let's finally move on to the lip swatches.
so let's talk about the formula and the pros of these liquid lipsticks now firstly these are super pigmented and they're very thin in consistency hey guys so i am editing right now and just a quick correction i do not know why i mentioned it is thin in consistency but it is not it is quite thick in consistency and it takes about 10 to 20 seconds for it to dry down and once it does dry down it settles into a matte finish which is very comfortable on the lips and it doesn't feel like you're wearing any lipstick at all now i really do like the arrow shaped applicator which is very similar to the smashbox liquid lipsticks and uh, these are quite soft and easy to apply the liquid lipsticks as well now these are also smudge proof and transfer proof as claimed like for example there is hardly any transfer and these do last for quite a long time now i wore it the other day for like about six to seven hours and then i had to eat but until then it was absolutely fine with the mask on and this is how it looks like once you have a heavy meal where you can still see the color now if it does fade off i would not suggest like rubbing your lips it's better to like reapply the liquid lipsticks overall for the removal of these liquid lipsticks, you will have to use an oil-based product. A micellar water will not work, even a face wash will not work. You have to use an oil-based product. I use the Garnier micellar water, that oil-infused one, and it works like a charm. Now, I love that they do offer like a wide range of shades, like 24 shades is a good range of colors, especially my personal favorite is shade number 10. Uh, 16 and this one 21 I love these three shades a lot like there are others as well but these are like the top tier favorites you know and the last pro is the pricing where these are priced only for 110 rupees which is quite affordable for 4 ml of product and now we're coming to the FIIs which is not personally like a con for me but then it could be a con for someone or I'm just letting you guys know about it the first point is that the arrow tip applicator which I do like but it does make it a bit tight for the wand to come out of the tube I'll put a video of it of what I'm exactly talking about but it's a little bit of a struggle and it's a little bit tight so yeah that's that and for the second point like I mentioned earlier it does take about 10 to 20 seconds for it to dry down but while it is drying if you do press or rub your lips together it does feel sticky so I would highly recommend to wait until it dries for like 20 seconds max and then you're good to go and now coming to the cons there is nothing to mention at all because overall I do love this collection especially the shades that I've picked out and I love the fact that these are only 110 rupees for 4 ml of product so yeah I do highly recommend these liquid lipsticks so yeah guys these were my thoughts on the inside cosmetics matte lip ink and this wraps today's video you guys i hope you all enjoyed it if you did do not forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon right next to it to notified whenever i upload as well as like the video and comment down below if you have any questions or requests i will try and miss it for you as well as follow me on my socials which is ishtanayar on instagram and ishtanayar on twitter as well so until the next time take care bye